Good morning. This morning, we're going to be working with measuring liquids and pretending to give different patients different doses of medicine. Let's get started. Here we have our first patient. Our first patient is Mr. Bear. It says, Mr. Bear needs 10 milliliters of medication. Which image below shows the correct dosage of medication? Let's look closely at each picture. We're looking for this number right here, the number 10, a one and a zero. We're gonna look at these two little cups. They're all measured in milliliters, which is the ML, and they have the numbers five, 10, and 15. We want to see which one has the medication filled to the line that is the number 10 line. Let's look. 5, 10. Does this cup have the medication filled to the 10 line? That's right, it does. So this is the correct cup. But let's take a look at this cup and see how much is in this cup. 5, 10, 15. This cup goes all the way up to the number 15, a 1 and a 5. This one has 15 milliliters. This one is the 10 milliliter, and this is the one that we should give to Bear. Let's get rid of this one. Here's our next patient. Ralph Raccoon needs 5 milliliters of medication. Which image below shows the correct dosage of medication? Look closely. You can see that they're numbered 5, 10, or 15. Look at both cups. Which cup has the liquid medication filled only to the number 5? Can you point to the one? Yes, that's right, it's this one. This one is filled just to five. What number is this cup filled until? Yes, 10, but we don't need 10. This is the correct medication for Ralph Raccoon. Great job. Our next patient is George Giraffe. He needs five milliliters of medication. Which image below shows the correct dosage of medication? Look closely at the lines. There's a line at five, a line at 10, and a line at 15 on both. Can you point to the one that has the medication coming up to the line that has the five next to it? That's right, it's this one. What number is this one up until? 15, that's right. So we don't need this one. This is the correct medication for George. Great job. Here's another patient named Timmy Kirtle. Have you noticed that some of our patients have had names that are alliterations? Timmy and Turtle both go t, t, t and start with the letter T. Timmy Turtle needs 15 milliliters of medication. Which image below shows the correct dosage of medication? Look closely. Which one has the medication coming up? to the line with the number 15 next to it. That's right, this one. So we don't need this one. Great job. Now we have a different way to measure the medication. Instead of a cup, we have these syringes. These are not exactly like shots because they don't have a needle. These can be put into the animal's mouth, and you can use the plunger at the bottom to squirt the medication in. This one is different in how you measure it. For this, you need to look at the very bottom of the plunger and see which line it most closely lines up to. Sammy Seal needs one milliliter of medication. Which image below shows the correct dosage of medication? Let's look. For this one, you can see that there's only medication at the very top. At what number does the white line meet? Let's look. This is the number one. Now let's look over here. On this syringe, the white line meets the line at number two. So this has one milliliter and this has two milliliters. Which one is the right one for Sammy Seal? That's right, this one. 
Sammy's seal needs one milliliter, and that's exactly how much is in this syringe. Great job! Our next patient is Daniela Duck. She needs four milliliters of medication, which image below shows the correct dosage of medication. Look closely at that white line I talked about. You can see the liquid medication above it. You need to see at what number it meets to be able to tell how much is in the syringe. I'm going to give you a few seconds to really look closely. Which one shows four milliliters? This one, that's right, the line right there. How many milliliters are in this one? That's right, one. We can get rid of that one, and this is the correct dosage for Daniela Duck. Great job. Here is our last patient, Matthew Moose. I made this a little more challenging. I've given you three syringes to look closely at and consider. Matthew Moose needs three milliliters of medication, which image below shows the correct dosage of medication. Look really closely at where that white line meets the black line and the number right next to it. You need to find the number three. Which one shows the number three? That's right, this one. Great job. Can you tell me how many milliliters are in this one? That's right, five. We don't need that one. How about this one? Can you tell me how many milliliters are in this one? Four, that's right. Do we need this one? No, I can delete it. We don't need this one. This is the correct one for Matthew Moose. Great job today. I hope you had fun.